Choosing a career and educational path after high school is one of the most important decisions you can make. In a time of life when there are more questions than answers, the Bridges Career Academies and Workplace Connection provides information about education and career pathways and gives you the tools you need to make a smart choice, one that's right for you and right for your future. This program provides an overview of some of the promising careers and educational opportunities available in information technology. IT professionals may specialize in working with software or hardware, but either way, their focus is on problem solving. If you choose a career in information technology, you will need advanced training and a commitment to updating your skills to adapt to a steady pace of innovation. As businesses upgrade computing systems to support faster, more powerful, and increasingly mobile networks, skilled computer professionals are in greater demand than ever. In fact, employment for the computer and information systems sector is projected to grow 18% from now through 2020. As a high school student, it is important to start preparing now for your future career. Ask your high school counselor about courses and other opportunities that will help you learn more about computers and IT so you can be prepared to pursue a diploma or certificate in a college-level information technology program. Central Lakes College with campuses in Brainerd and Staples offers diploma programs in Computer Information Technology, Network Administration, Computer Support Specialist, and a Help Desk Specialist Certificate Program. You may be eligible to apply for a Bridges Scholarship through the Central Lakes College Foundation to help fund your studies. Depending on which program you choose, you can complete your training in just one or two years and be on your way to a rewarding career. Your education at CLC will also prepare you to obtain industry certification and lay the groundwork for future education and training. My name is Mike Daniels, and I am the Network Administrator for Grandview Lodge. I went to high school in Aiken. I always had uh, a disposition towards computers, and I decided that you know, maybe I should go to school for that. And then I went to Central Lakes and got started there. They have the Associate in Applied Science for General IT or Network Administration, which is what I went for. There's not as many nerds with glasses and pocket protectors as there once were. Most of the people that I know, by the time that they're graduating after their two-year program, either have jobs or have jobs lined up for when they graduate. I actually have a passion for hardware. So, um, you know, any day that I have, I have computers that are breaking down or whatever, I love doing that, that underlying detective work to find out what's going on. There's actually a lot I love about my job. I, I love implementing new technologies. I, I love troubleshooting hardware and software problems. There's so many possibilities and there's so many different areas in the IT world. You have telecommunications, you have virtualization, you have hardware, you have networking, and so many different areas that you can either specialize in or, or dabble in them all. Or There's lots of jobs for like help desk support. There's um, system engineer jobs available, and then obviously network administrators or system administrators. There, there's a lot of um, opportunities in this area. And it's, it's such a, a great field to work in. There's tons of opportunities out there. There's always jobs in IT no matter where you go, and there's always new things to learn and, and, and ways to, to better yourself. Twelve years ago when we bought this company, we really only did work in Brainerd, Minnesota. But now, you know, last week I was in Tulsa, two weeks before that I was in Houston. Why? Because my clients are all over the place. I've got clients in Switzerland, I have a client in Ireland, uh, but it doesn't matter because I'm sitting here in Brainerd and I can fully support them remotely. I'm Janelle Riley. I'm the owner of Savannah's Technologies. Um, Savannah's Technologies is a technology services firm. We are not just server guys or PC guys. We are people who understand a business and then solve those problems. We bought this retail computer store, we started to develop an engineering practice, started to expand more deeply into technology, then we moved from there more into business consulting and finally cloud-based technologies and now we are very heavily cloud-based, in fact almost exclusively cloud-based. The number one concern of every IT firm is how do you find enough people? We need people who have the right qualities, they have the creative problem solving, they have the business skills, they have the communication skills, and frankly, there just aren't enough of them around. Um, for anyone nationwide, there are not enough. 
We don't want people that just want a job. We want people that live it, breathe it, love it. The number one thing an employer is looking for in IT is a lifelong learner. They have to be someone who is willing to take the time to learn and learn and learn. It's a industry that is 100% in flux. What we do this year is nowhere near what we'll do next year and nowhere near what we'll do the next year. So you have to be someone who wants to learn and grow and, and continue to make this a career that they continue to grow with. You can be anywhere you want to be and, and, and have a full-fledged career in IT with a high level, good paying career and live wherever you want. And certainly in this area, it's a great place to live and do that. So that's why we're here. To find out more about educational opportunities and careers in information technology, contact your guidance counselor or visit us online at bridgesconnection.org. Major funding for this video was provided by the Blandin Foundation and by these Bridges supporters.